When cropping images for effect, the hard part is taking the photo. The putting it together in InDesign is easy. So the basic step is on. you want to create a new document. You want to make sure its number of pages is 2 and the start page is 2. That way you get a two-page spread in your document. Next, you bring in your photo. Just drag it in from your folder and drag it. Don't make it too big so you have room on your page for the other crops. So I have the one image. Now if you hold on your Alt key, you can drag your photo and make a copy of it. I'm going to resize it. Try not to do tiny slivers of photos. Try to keep a regular size shape photo. So I'm going to move that over and I'm going to take my photo and I'm going to crop it so it matches matches that image. So I'm going to make it a little larger and make him fit into that photo. Now to make another copy of that, I'm going to hold down my Alt key, drag down again, and now I can go in here and I can say, okay, I just want the Granville Street Bridge. So I'm going to pull on that, click on the circle to enlarge it and open it up and just get my photo on here. And one last one, I'm going to click on it again, hold down my Alt key one more time, make another copy of it and then I can move it so I just have this building cropped. So now I have three different crops out of one image. The last thing I need to do is take my text tool, create, drag a box, and give it a reason. So for my first image, I'm saying I want to focus on the kayak and remove all distracting info. So there we go. And your description should be clear enough that you won't have to number the photos uh, because each one should be an individual enough crop. So once you've done that for one image, you do repeat that for the second image on the other side. And when complete, just submit the InDesign file for marking.